What's up viewers, it's SK, and man, it's been some time. In reference to my previous hiatus from YouTube, no, I haven't been dead. Nor was I abducted by super advanced androids from the future. Not at all. Actually, I've been working on streaming and getting more comfortable with my streaming skin. And no, that's not a play at the androids again. <laughs> I mean, I used to be really shy, so showing up on camera was a big step for me. And while as that follows, streaming was the next big step. So with that said, insert a shameless plug here, follow my Twitch at twitch.tv slash forever. You can also find that link in the description. And don't forget to hit that follow button, because every bit of support helps. As it turns out, I'm pretty interactive when I stream. It's just that no one actually speaks in my chat, so... I'm talking to myself most of the time, so maybe you can change that. Anyway, today we're here to talk about Bless Online, and yes, I'm still playing Bless. The Assassin class was recently released about two weeks ago or three weeks ago right now, and I've been actually enjoying playing the Assassin class. I've been leveling it up on stream, and I finally maxed it out like, I guess, three days ago, and I've been farming to, you know, get my gear and stuff. But once again, the guild that I was in has left the game, so currently looking for a guild, you know, hook your boy up. I'm 28, married, I love long walks on the beach, and soothing chats in Discord up until midnight. And you know, if you have me in Discord, you can have this soothing voice every night. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby, yeah! But yeah, the assassins are cool as shit. I recommend that you actually, if you were waiting for the class, you could come back and try the game out again. Because they have changed, they have upgraded a lot of things. Um, for the most part, I haven't seen an upgrade in the optimization yet. But the game does run a bit smoother for me. Then again, I got my SSD back, so I don't really know if that's a part of that or not. That being said, I haven't covered content for the game for a while. So you see, they've had they've added on um, Siege of Cash to the 70 versus 70 PvP, which I currently am getting stomped in over and over. I mean, that's a normal thing regardless in PvP. Um, they added a 3v3 arena, actually, which is pretty fun, actually, to me. To me, it's fun. To other people, they don't really like it. Um, they actually did one fix that people really did want. They waited a long time to fix it, but this is a recent fix. They took out the fact that your runes break from mobs in the battlegrounds. I don't know why they waited so long to do that, but they finally have done it, so we don't lose runes anymore in battlegrounds, which is a good thing. They've also added the Migratorist Elite, and they've added new weapons to the game, and increased drop rates for the weapons and armor in the game, so you won't just be running for... You won't be doing blank runs anymore. And you'll be getting a lot more gold ore, actually. I've been noticing that I'm getting a lot more gold ore in running Migratorius and Palazzo Ruins. Or is it Patala Ruins? It's one of those two. There's actually a leveling event going on for the Assassin right now, and it is a 100% um, ESP boost. It's a 50% ESP boost for um, a new character, and a 50% ESP boost for playing an Assassin. So you're getting 100% ESP boost for both of those being jammed together. And that goes, also goes with the 1 hour 100% um, 20% ESP boost you can buy from the specialty shop, and the ones you get from leveling up. Out the gate, they had to nerf the assassin like pretty quickly, but it's a pretty balanced class. Like since the game has come out, every class can kill the assassin, and assassin can kill every class, as long as you know you're not running away or they're not running away. Also, in addition to the production letters they've been doing, they've actually started doing community videos as well that pretty much update you on what's coming in the game. And the videos they they pretty much showcase you know the things that are going to come up and what we should be expecting. And they go into more detail than the production letters do, actually. I'm not sure what gave them the idea that we needed that, but they're trying to do something. So I guess we'll go ahead and see how that turns out. Along with that, the secondary round of emissary applications will be starting eventually. They said soon, but I haven't seen soon yet. So it's a soon.tm moment. Um, except pay attention to the Facebook and Twitter. I might be applying again this time. I applied the first time I didn't get into it for obvious reasons. Um, but hopefully I can get into it this time. Hopefully I can make some type of difference. If not, then, well, you know where that goes. So yeah, back to my Twitch. I do play a lot of other games on my Twitch. And sometimes I don't even, I don't even play on my PC. I'm playing on my PS4. So sometimes there won't be um, video because I don't have a PS4 camera. I'm not sure if my laptop camera works for my PS4. I'm pretty sure it doesn't. But um, yeah, so sometimes I won't be on video. I'll just be playing games and talking. Either way, I'm very interactive on Twitch, so once again, give me a follow. Hmm, Rita Raposa. She can make my monster grow in a time. Wait, was that on air? Once again, I'm 
again, I know it's been a while, but thank you guys for watching this video. Thank you guys for coming out and subscribing, uh, liking, and sharing this video. If you haven't done so already, I'm just telling you what your future is going to be. Um, go ahead and, you know, check the description, get your links up, hit the follow buttons wherever you go, and share it out. And thanks for watching. Peace.